you are welcome to Sri Lanka to observe about our activities pertaining to monthly operations in Sri Lanka, including Aranayaka in the Cape of this way. And both of you have been with me for the last two days and uh, we have been involving in two county discussions and uh, you know in and out about the way funds come, how we are going to take it. Uh, as much as possible to ensure that the transparency, efficiency and the proper things, equipment, whatever, reserve things will be gone to victims. And uh, we would like to know about your opinion regarding our cooperation. Thank you very much for, for hosting us this past couple of days. First off, we are so grateful uh, by the Sri Lankan kindness and the generosity from hosting us. Uh, it's been truly a blessing to be in this country um, and it feels like home for us. Uh, when we first found out about this project, we contacted your daughter and she was more than welcome to uh, administer as much help as possible to getting, getting us here and getting us accustomed to the culture and uh, informed about what the project is, is about. Uh, second most, when we first arrived here, uh, yes, the hospitality was amazing and uh, sitting in on these meetings, we noticed, first of all, the transparency that was provided at these meetings, knowing that uh, who was donating, where the money was going, and uh, showing that uh, these funds were properly used uh, in helping the, the people that are in need. So that was uh, for mostly the most important thing that we saw here is the transparency and uh, the uh, the amazing leadership that was provided by the DMO here um, to, uh, to facilitate uh, the groups of people, uh, to make sure that everyone around the table was heard, and to uh, facilitate the needs of the people that are affected. So your leadership truly uh, is astonishing. Uh, you can tell by the, the shape of your hospital here and uh, by the people that respect you. So. Uh, again, that is uh, one thing that we noticed and that we know that this relief is in good hands. Yeah, so the transparency absolutely was very clear from the beginning. I didn't expect to have all the information and uh, allotment of the funds so quickly arranged. Uh, the other thing that is very important is seeing, uh, looking at their needs and, and going to what is already provided and how can you go beyond that. So that has been very efficient. And the other thing is the time, the time frame. The meetings have been very efficient, very quick and directly in, impacting individuals as soon as possible. So that has been a wonderful wonderful thing to observe. And then what I also really like is, is looking at the problems, but also looking ahead. It's not just looking at what has happened and what, where the funds will go, it's also looking in the future, knowing what will happen. And after attending your talk on climate change, really observing how the future will be shaped uh, due to the climate change, uh, being able to plan ahead for that and looking at where the funds will be needed to be allotted is very, very important. So I have been very, very pleased by the efficiency of all the work here. Mm -hmm. Especially taking a step forward and looking at possible landslides to happen mm -hmm. uh, and evacuating those people before any more damage can happen. That is that's very good to see. And. The most important thing is the, knowing that uh, in the future a house will be built and to look at where individuals will be living. So finding a good shelter and being able to provide that I think is very, very important. So knowing that funds will be going to a future house where people can live and have safe, safe uh, mm -hmm. housing is very important. Mm -hmm. And the re uh, resettlement of these people to safer locations uh, as well as providing them with, with houses. That's what we hope to do with, um, with our kind of campaign is to uh, bring awareness to our region uh, and, and show and share the, uh, 
the efforts being put into that and also maybe collecting some funds so we can provide housing for these individuals that are in need of shelter. Thank you very much. Thanks. Thank you very much again for coming to Sri Lanka for your time. Thank you. Very soon, I hope. Thank you.